Perfectly whipped egg whites are the secret that makes cakes and souffles rise. They make waffles and pancakes light and airy, and when sweetened, make those delicious meringues that we all love. Now, when a recipe calls for soft, firm, or stiff peaks, do you really know what that means? Well, today I'm gonna show you how to whip your egg whites to all three of those stages and what to do if your egg whites turn out overbeaten like this here. So, the very first step, you have to make sure that you have room temperature egg whites. So I have six egg whites here and a clean mixing bowl. You wanna use either glass, stainless steel, sometimes people use copper, but you wanna make sure that it is free of grease or detergent. So a very clean bowl and a whisk attachment. You start at a lower speed. So I'm gonna start off at two here. And as you whip, you want to increase the speed. And what this does is it creates smaller bubbles instead of giant bubbles that will help in creating a very stable whipped egg white. So I've been on medium low speed for a little while. You can see that the egg whites, they look a little foamy, sudsy like soap. And this is when you wanna increase the speed even more. So we're building those tiny bubbles, but we need a little bit more speed to create even more volume. So my mixer has been running for a few minutes. The egg whites are nice and fluffy. And to check whether or not this is at soft peaks, what you need to do is remove the whisk and you're going to turn it upside down. And what should happen here, exactly what's happening, the peak itself does not hold its shape. It flops over to one side. So this is what you would consider to be soft peaks. Now, if you're making a recipe that calls for adding sugar, to your egg whites, this is the point at which you want to gradually add it, soft peak stage. And then you would continue to beat it until it's stiff and glossy. But I'm gonna keep going and I'm gonna show you the next stage, which would be firm peaks. So it's been another few minutes. And now what you're looking for is a little bit more structure. And you can really tell here, you see the tip of the peak, it folds over slightly, it doesn't stand straight up. So this is what we would consider to be firm peaks. Now, I'm gonna keep mixing and show you the last stage, which would be stiff peaks. So now the final stage, stiff peaks are just that. They stand straight up. A stiff meringue or a stiff egg whites like this would be used for folding into cake batters, hard meringues that you bake into the oven, things like that. Now, I'm gonna show you overbeaten and what you can do to fix your overbeaten egg whites. So keep mixing. So as you can see, the egg whites are chunky, they're kind of grainy and clumpy and dull in color. So you don't have to start over. There is a little trick in bringing this back, or at least trying to, and that is by adding another egg white. Now make sure your egg white's at room temperature. Just dump it right into the bowl. And then I like to do this by hand. Don't put it back on the machine. Gently mix this together, and you should have beautiful stiff peaks now that you can use in any recipe. There you go, enjoy.